hello. We're gonna play some uh, mercenaries today. Came out today. Dude, the Roblox stream was funny as fuck. I mean, we just had a good time. I feel like Roblox is kind of a, I feel like that's a really easy way to be able to hit up other streamers and just go, hey, do you wanna just do this for a few hours? Because one of the things that's actually kind of difficult uh, streaming is th 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 there's so many people to reach out to or talk to or whatever. And it's like, oh, what about you? Do you wanna do something? Maybe I'll do something with you. Maybe I'll do something. And it's like, oh, what do you want to do? And it's like, oh, fuck. Um, uh, what do uh, what do we want to do? I think that's a very simple thing just to be like, let's go ride roller coasters and Roblox for an hour. <laughs> it's just easy. It's simple and fun. I mean, it is it is whatever you decide to make it, I guess. There's a lot of stuff on Roblox from what I've been told. And I don't know, a lot of it is probably not very good. There's probably a ton of really just... There's a lot of really, really good things. There's probably a lot of really bad things, too. I don't know anything about it. I don't know. There could be a lot of things that aren't very good. Is that why people have opinions on it? I don't know. I don't know anything about it. Nice centrist take. That's how you walk it back real quick. <laughs> no, I, I, I genuinely don't know. My only experience with Roblox was two and a half hours two days ago. I don't know anything about the platform at all. But... I had a lot of fun. I thought it was, I thought it was a really good, enjoyable experience. So I'm probably gonna do more. Oh, by the way, I put like a, I put a warning on the VOD, on the last VOD. I was considering like doing a highlight to remove that really bad jump scare part, but hopefully a warning in the VOD is enough. The whole point of a jump scare is that there's no warning. Uh, I think a jump scare, when you know a jump scare is possible, is different than when it just like attacks you out of nowhere for no reason. My favorite part of the entire stream a couple days ago was the incredible detective work that I did in one second to accuse Stir of doing that. There's so many layers as to how that happened. If, if you watch that whole segment, that whole, five minutes before that segment, that whole thing and like a minute or two after that, it's just everything in my brain was, you, you can even see, I'm like, oh, you, you, you did that, you piece of shit. <laughs> it was, it was just a, the way that like the turn, turn up the volume on Stur's, uh, Stur's Discord to, hey, dude, he's quiet, he's quiet. Dude, Stur even screams right before I turn him up. He go, I'm like, oh, Stur's quiet. He goes, ah, and then it goes, so it's like, holy shit, there's no way you didn't do that. And then he laughs. He like laughs at it is so unbelievable just how much I could have. I thought it was him. It's so, so funny. Like just how I thought that. I mean, the jump scare sucked. And obviously I hope that that's not something I ever want to have to show anybody unprompted. But the whole thing leading up to that and after that of my accusal of stir. I think is my favorite part so far. Wrap it up, Albertson. <laughs> hey. All right, you guys ready? Let's just play. All right, let's go. So how this works is you just kind of shoot, run around, and pick up stuff. You get a time limit. Defeat as many enemies as possible within the time limit, taking them out in quick succession mode from a combo. They will earn you points. Yeah, you want to keep a combo together. So we're just going to get the swing of it again. It's been a while. All right, you also want to make sure you, you keep combos. Don't kill everybody because... You might run out of people to kill. Oops. I remember back in the day getting a, I think it was like more, it, it was an insane combo. I forget what I used to be able to get. What is mayhem mode? What is going on? You can go, it's like extra fast attack speed and more time. So you build up the mayhem meter. Oh, wait, at this power ups too, I think. No, don't lose the combo. No! Good, okay, we're good. Open the door. Oh my goodness. All right, wait. I'll be happy. I'll be happy with 50. Somebody said, is this really in Roblox? <laughs> no, it's not. No, it's, it's not. Oh my goodness, that person's got a. Oh my god. Oh my god! I gotta get out of here. No! The combo. Forget about the combo, I might be dead. <laughs> what did I just do? What is going on? Okay, whatever. 340,000 is pretty good for first run. 
91. Damn it. The, the coveted 100 hit combo. Everybody has different weapons as well. Bro, if it wasn't, if it hadn't have been for Cotton Eye Joe, I'd been married a long time ago, bro. I'm just going to, I'm going to purge that comment personally. I just did it. And that's like kind of, like, that was kind of funny. <laughs> the fact that they put long in all capitals. I would, I would have been married a long time ago. Okay. Let's, uh, so this is mainly rifle. Yeah, Leon has like everything. I will right, we'll do Lewis. Use your ability. I will once I get enough people here. Ow. Whoa, what? What just happened? Oh, that's dynamite. I didn't know. Okay. I didn't know that's what he that's what he did. That's cool. Oh my god, that was so lucky. That was so unbelievably lucky. We're doing fine. I gotta kill that guy down there with the sniper rifle. <laughs> oh, sorry, dude. You stood up at the worst possible time. Oy. Somebody is just dropping. Okay, I'm, I'm in trouble if I don't. I don't even know what I don't, I don't even know where I am on the screen. My screen is just bloom effect. Oh my god, he's right there. I can't jump down. Oh my god, I can't jump down. I'm so dead. I just like it. I think I was lost. I don't have any more heals left. Ugh! I need heals. Is that a heal? No, it's a flash grenade. Shit. What? Wait, all I killed everybody. I killed everybody. What? I'm running around looking for to get to the next position, but I I killed every single enemy. This is gonna be insane. <laughs> nice. Die! Oh my god, he didn't die! What the hell? Why is this guy made out of fucking steel? What? I shot him a thousand times! Oh my goodness, it's... <laughs> There's too many people! There's too many people there, but I, I have to kill them all. Collect every item! Alright, now get the hell out of here. Oh man, alright, this is gonna be another rest. What is it, 500k for us, probably? But I don't, what did I eat for breakfast this morning? Because I'm going to eat it every single day, whatever it was. <laughs> what, did I, what did I eat for dinner last night? Because I'm going to eat it every single fucking day. I, whatever my routine was over the last 12 hours, 24 hours, I need to go scientifically write this all down. I want to take Hunk to the village, I think. What does Hunk got? Hunk not only has a high-performance submachine gun, but also a unique melee attack that can kill instantly. During mayhem mode, he gains unlimited ammo. Damn. <laughs> okay, all right. Looks good. Is there a reason to press any other buttons with this character? I'm about to get uh, unlimited ammo. I'm gonna try it, what's it do? Damn, all right, that's, I should not have used that. I didn't even know what it, all right, this is so cool. I wasted that so bad though. Oh no 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 <laughs> I'm so dead. <laughs> seven. I need seven. I don't care if it hurts me. Oh, that's all right. Fuck. Oh, I was so close. I just freaked out. Shit. That's all right. Why did I do that? I thought, okay. I thought the chainsaw person was right behind me swinging. So I, I just tried to get as many kills as possible in the last second. I thought I was dead. You threw two grenades at your feet? Well, because if I threw if I threw it any further, I thought I was going to just overshoot everybody. So right there, I knew, I in my mind, I'm dead. I was just going for points. 
Because I was like, I'm dead here no matter what. Throw it! <laughs> He's doing it on purpose now. I'm out of sh I'm out of stuff. No! Reload the gun, you fucking dope! What are you doing? I need that hu Okay, we're fine. Oh, shit! I'm not gonna get a hundred! <laughs> Fuck! Where is everybody? Where are all the- Oh my god, you all ran the other way! They all went the long way to get over here. I don't even know where I'm shooting! <laughs> Break her neck, break her neck. Oh, I have no bullets. Oh my god. <laughs> this is so scary. I have to do it. Come here. Yes. <laughs> That was so fucking crazy. Thank God I did it. That's so sad. 98. Damn. It's okay. Give me that 100. I need it! Oh my God! The fucking flop! The panic! I flopped! I'm good. Got it. Yes! 100 kills. Hell yeah. All right. I thought I just blew it so bad. I have no fucking bullets. Shoot! <laughs> I'm so dead. I'm so I'm dead, dude. <laughs> Fuck. Wait, where's my bonus? Wait, what? I didn't get a bonus? No bonus for all the, the combo? No, if you die, it doesn't count. What? Oh, I thought that meant like, oh, you have 110 combo going. When you die, it'll add it. You have to actually be alive still. Get off of me, you fucking asshole! <laughs> oh my god, they're all doing the same stupid wrestling move from like WWE. Get the fuck off of me! Oh my god, it's so annoying. Oh my god. What? I, I was in the. <sighs> Dude, I was in the menu and I, pre I Super Mario jumped a second time. Oh, let me just grab you from behind and like hold your arms back. There you go. Oh, let me grab you from behind and hold your arms back. Hey, hold on. Let me get, let me sneak back behind you. Grab your arms from behind. Get the fuck out of here. Oh, hey, did somebody just do that? Nah, don't worry, dude. I'm gonna do that too. Did somebody just do that to you? Hey, watch out! I'm doing it now on you. Hey, can I can I sneak back behind here? That was going so well too. Three random dickheads have to just do the full Nelson move two or three times in a row. <laughs> fuck you guys. Fuck you guys. That move is stupid. Get out of here. Oh, hold on. Let me grab. I fucking hate these things. I... <laughs> he just. All right. Wait, I need. I... Okay. I got to restart. Okay. I fell off the bridge. Holy shit. Look at this thing. Do it. It's... Oh my God. It's like playing Tomb Raider sometimes. Dude, I... Oh my god, you little bug fuckers, get away from me! Is that ammo? Oh shit, it is. Ay, ay, ay! Ay, ay, ay! <laughs> 100. All right, we're good. Oh my goodness. Ooh. Oh my god, how am I still I don't care. I don't care. It's okay. We're okay. We're okay. We're okay. Everyone relax. That was just a that was a little fucked up. That guy's going to fold Nelson in me and I'm going to scream. Why are you reloading this gun? Who told you to do something so stupid? Oh! <laughs> ah! <laughs> I gotta, I gotta fucking mute. 
I gotta do scopes here. I'm so stressed out right now. Oops! <laughs> Dude, get me out of here! I can't move! I can't move! Help! Holy shit, I'm so fucking dead here, guys. All right, I gotta go this and I gotta flashbang immediately. No. You gotta be kidding me, dude. Give me a fucking break. All right, just one more. Where are they? Wow, they're behind me. I did it all. Clean. We're good. All right. Woo. Too bad. I didn't get 130 combo. 129. Oh, <laughs> so close. Damn it. Oh, close. Oh, shit. <laughs> I have to get out of here. Get out of my way, please. I have to get out of here. <laughs> This dude is just turning. I'm I'm all right. I'm okay. I'm all right. Oh! <laughs> There's gotta be a fucking grenade in here. Is there a grenade in here? Yes! <laughs> oh, thank God. <sighs> oh, my goodness gracious. Nice. That laugh was legit psycho. You turned into the Joker? So he said Beavis and Butthead maniacal laugh? I'm just gaming, man. I don't know what you guys are even talking about. Hold on. Let's hear it. I mean, I would I would say it's more like Bale from Diablo 2. You just put, all right, put some filters on that, put some echo on it, and some kind of grunge on it, and that will be when you stand still in the, uh, the, what, the World Sanctuary, wherever it is. And he goes like, <laughs> right? My brothers will not die in vain, 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 vain. Yeah. Oh, here's Bale's laugh. Okay, let's, let's see, let's compare it. My brothers will not have died in vain. <laughs> uh, you know, I always thought I was a Bale. I don't know. If I was gonna pick what Diablo character. Oh shit! Ooh! This is the one! This is the one! This is the one! Where's the last enemy? Where's the last enemy? Ah! Oh my god! Yes! Holy shit! Oh, I did it! Oh, that's... Thank God. Oh my God. I thought I was going to miss it big time right there at the end. Nice YouTuber reaction. Oh, that was real. That may, that may have sounded fake. That was genuine. I was about to get really, really sad. Dude. I'm the 10,611th best gamer in the world on Island with Hunk in Resident Evil 4 Remake. All right. I'm going to take a quick break. That was really fun. This was Resident Evil 4 Remake's uh, mercenaries mode. I heavily enjoyed it. Uh, well, I'll play something else for a little bit. You know, it's funny. Anytime I go BRB, even if I know the mic is muted, I don't do, I don't talk until I'm out of the room. Like if I have to burp or fart or something really bad, I, even if I mute it over here, I, I'm doing, not, I'm not doing that till I'm out of the room. I, don't, I just don't, sometimes I just don't trust it. I don't know. Paranoid Perry. Well, let me tell you something. If I'm not paranoid, Perry, and for some reason I'm sitting here and I rip ass really, really loud with a BRB screen up. You that you want to talk about a clip that will be shared a hundred thousand times forever. You guys you guys will link that to me and hide it. Like, oh hey dude, um uh oh Diablo 4 is getting some uh, some updates. Click this, and it's gonna be me farting with the BRB screen. You know, I I know what you guys are capable of. <sighs> Well. 
I wouldn't hold it against you if you unfollowed. You know what I mean? Like, I, I get it. I do. Do it louder. No. Oh, what about, um... Ooh. What about Chop Goblins? This has been on the list for a long time. And this is... I think this is pretty short. Isn't this only like an hour or two? Yeah, let's do that. Let's, that sounds fun. I already love it. All right, look, sensitivity's going down. Let's try that. Kids mode. What is kids mode? All right, let's do it. Okay, select difficulty. Explore the levels with no enemies or UI. <laughs> You're new to PC shooters or just want a chill experience. Ooh. That's kind of chill. So this is a chill stream. The intended balance for a first playthrough or goblin mode. Uh, I'll do, I'll do this one. The year is 1984. On a whim one evening, you decide to break into the local museum's basement and see what sort of treasures it might hold. One dusty wooden chest catches your eye. You open it, and a mob of strange creatures leaps out. This particular chest was secretly a prison for the malevolent Chop Goblins, lured inside by the promise of delicious cheese and trapped for untold eons. They are now loose to wreak havoc on the world once more. You know what must be done. Grabbing an antique dagger from a pile of dusty artifacts, you give chase. An antique dagger you grab from a nearby crate. Not the best weapon, but it's better than nothing. And a skilled welder might be able to deflect thrown projectiles with it. You can also do a quick dagger attack at any time, regardless of what weapon you have out, by pressing the use button. Whoa. All right, I gotta turn sensitivity down. All right, Goldilocks. Sensitivity is probably the most important thing in PC gaming. I don't care if you have a, a GTX 3090, an RTX 4080, six monitors and like a, a fucking i10, like 55 million. If your sensitivity is wrong, you're gonna do dog shit in games. Is this still the Resident Evil 4 remake? What am I doing? You gonna play Stalker 2 when it comes out? Um, I, don't, I think the Stalker games, my brain is not big enough for them. Although I did play the those old Stalker games. What was it on, on like master difficulty or something? I played it on some difficulty that was really, really, oh no, like realism. It was like realistic mode or something. What was it called? People said, no, no, play on that one because that's like the best one to play on. Something like that. I don't even know what, was, what, what they yell, and if you're in line of sight, it hurts you. What are they saying? We want some cheese. <laughs> we some cheese. Yeah, where's the cheese? I like the chop goblins. You're related to these goblins. Hey, hey, yeah. Hey, back off. Hey, back off. How's that sound? Calm down, bro. Hey. <laughs> Here's an idea. And just like kind of put this around in your brain for a second. Back off. He's, why is he so pissed? Hey, back off. Remember, did you ever have a goth phase? <laughs> no, you should start now. I don't think I want to start a goth phase at 40. I don't know if I want to do that. I don't think, uh-uh. I don't think I can pull it off. Goth is ageless. Being goth is ageless. Yeah, I, I'm just telling you, I don't think I could pull it off right now. One day, should I just turn on the webcam and just have just like straight, straight black hair? Do like put like powder all over my face or something and have like dark, like put like bags into my eyes. Wear like a cloak. Put Be like Count Dracula for a day. Should do it on Halloween. Okay. I might. I might... I don't know. I can't. This is not a Roblox birthday party promise. I kind of already have done this in a way with the whole like, oh, like Lucius Malfoy. Didn't I? Kind of. That does not count. I don't think Bugleberry. No, Bugleberry is not goth. I don't, I don't know about that. Bugleberry to me is like, are you afraid of the dark Nickelodeon? That's like, whatever that is. Like, campy horror. I don't know what you would call it. Did he tell you to say that? No, I'm just... It's an observation. Yeah, he's like a Goosebumps villain. Yeah, yeah, like, are you afraid of the dark? Goosebumps. I have been told that that is the intent. The intent of that, uh, for, that is what I have been told. That that's what they were going for. That's what he's been going for. Who told you that? Hey, 
Hey. Back off. What the hell is that? No, honestly, what the hell is that? <laughs> Dude, come on, man. I, I'm gonna show this, but like, what the fuck are people doing? Is this on Redbubble? Oh my god. Why? This is apparently like a like a throw blanket on Redbubble. No, I uh uh I don't I don't want to do it. I don't want to do it. I'm not doing it. <laughs> I'm not doing it. It's this fucking picture where I got like the sun in my face from like at like TwitchCon like 2017 or something. I don't even know when this is. Oh my goodness. Wait, people actually own this thing? No. I okay, I'm gonna stop giving this attention. I want one of these. You know what I mean? I'm, I'm never I'm never gonna have one of these. But if I if you told me to just okay, dream, dream house. I just want like a nice clear, cool, just little pool, not a big one. Everybody I don't like big pools. I just want a little place for me to go sink and just like soak down to my chest and just like ah just for a little bit. Like a hot tub. A hot tub that's not just hot water. I just want to sit in a little, just like this. And I want there to be like a big plant right here. I want there to be like oxygen producing from like cactuses, plants and shit all over here. You know what I'm saying? You want a bathtub. This is way bigger than a bathtub. Let's use the chop goblin as um, sort of a scale here. This is big enough for like five people to sit in. I, I, and I want it for me. I don't want anybody else sitting in this. This is for me, not for anybody else. This is not a case where like, oh yeah, come over here, come over here and piss in my pool. No, 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 no. This is for me to sit in here and decompress. Holly could use it too. Yeah. No, yeah, that's, oh no, no. I'm, I'm just talking no outside, other oh, outside people could use it. <laughs> I wouldn't even tell anybody I had it. Because you know the first second somebody would be, oh my god. The second that somebody finds out you have one of those, Oh, sick! Oh, cool! Yeah! And they start talking. They're, they're taking their shirt off. He's like, no, it's, <laughs> we're not. Uh, yeah, we could, but uh, oh, dude, really? You got a little, a little pool like that? Let's go! I'm getting in. No, no, dude. no, 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 no! Don't go in that. I don't know. Oh, call me a weirdo if you want. No, it's all right, man. Just dump a bunch of shock in it. <laughs> oh, sorry, I puked in your nice, pristine pool. No, just dump shock in here. It'll be fine. No, what? No, I want a clean pool. I don't want to fucking puke in my pool. I don't want to piss in my pool. Yeah, sorry, man. I accidentally I peed and shit in your pool, but it's all right. Just that white powder that you sprinkle in that, like, with chemicals, just dump it in there and it'll get rid of the puke. <laughs> Dude, you're never coming over again. And you can't... The, here's the thing about a pool. There is no verifying anything in a pool a lot of times. There is absolutely no verification. So... Somebody could just be in there pissing, and it's just like, I have no idea, and nobody else does, and no one will ever know. There's no verification when somebody goes in a pool. Okay, you know those shows where they, um, they kind of redo your whole house, and after a week, you come back, and they, you have, like, a blindfold on, and you take it off in the living room, and it's like, oh my goodness, look at all this! It doesn't matter what my house or what my apartment, whatever it looked like before, just in the middle of the living room, just make a nice, pristine, blue square chest high pool and I'm gonna cry I'm gonna do this I'm gonna be like <laughs> you, you can't even they put look what they put in they put the pool they did what I, uh, I liked I would cry and I, there could be rotten wood all over here and I wouldn't matter as long as I was there it, but the water has to be faintly lit with like a light blue like kind of slightly teal light and the Twinsons Odyssey soundtrack has to play in the background I don't know who did the voice acting in that game but it is unironically, and I mean this, I mean this 100% truthfully. That game has some of the best voice acting of any game I've ever played. Oh, it's, it, it's no, I, I think it's less than a few people even doing the voice work. And they do dozens of characters, and they're so good. There's so much life and so much energy and so much passion in that voice work. It just, trust me when I tell you, it, it's, it's phenomenal. The characters that people do, oh, the elephant voices, oh my goodness. You're gonna make me cry. Why are you walking in circles? Uh. Oh, uh, right. Should we? Should we tell? All right, let's tell. Uh, when I get on a topic, uh, I will just walk in a circle and just forget that I'm playing a video game and just—it's probably annoying. I'm sorry. Uh, I've been doing this for like 12 years. I'm sorry. Has there ever been a time when I've played a game 
and didn't just like absentmindedly go on autopilot in a circle while I was talking. No, it's never happened. You don't have a multitasking talent. You know, I can carry a lot of things at the same time. I don't know if that counts, but you bet your ass I'm getting the entire grocery run in one go. That's multitasking. You got one on your pinky hanging, one on your thumb, one sort of wrapped around your left hand, one gripped. You have it bunched up tight. You take the two ends and you bunch it up tight. You got like 10 bags in your hand. That's just a, that's not a multitask. Oh, can you sing while you do it too? Okay. Back off. I think I just like natural shit. Remember I told you one of my favorite things is the sticky kind of gooey lava where it's charcoal looking and then they hit it with that little stick and it opens up and it's like lava. I want a room like this too in my house. I should have been like a scientist. Like a by all I don't know. I should have gone into something to do with that. I mean, I could always just wear a like a fisherman's cap and have sunscreen all over my nose. Have like a bowling shirt on with a camera around my neck and a fanny pack and have my wrists, both of them, planted on my back walking around and following the other scientists going like, wow, what you, wow, look at that. Oh, wow. Oh, can I get a picture of that? I can just be, I can just go on like vacation. Just be a geologist orbiter. Did you play Seaman again? No. You guys have to understand the reason why the, oh. The re- hold on. The reason why those games were some of the longest streams I've ever done is because I didn't want to turn those games on ever again. Because I know if I turned the Dreamcast off, that game would never be opened again. So I had to stick with it because that was the only time you were ever going to see that. So it had to be like a 13 hour, 14 hour stream. Hey, Germa. Ligma. What's that? Ligma. What is that? <laughs> this is cool looking. Zordon? Destroy the cyber goblin to set things right. You emerge gasping from the time portal back in the museum basement. Your own time, just as you'd left it. But what of the chop goblins? You glance frantically out the window. The city streets are miraculously undestroyed and unchopped. The nightmare is over. Then your eye catches something in the corner. The dusty old chest that had imprisoned the chop goblins is still there and still open. The chop goblins are still out there somehow, waiting for the opportunity to chop again. Oh. Come on, Vinny. You beat me by fucking 2,000 points? That's funny. Loser POV. Vinny beat you because he played DMC5. Hmm. I'll have to be a good gamer and check it out. All right, tell me the truth. And I, Devil May Cry, I've never played it. Not even for one second. I've only seen trailer gameplay footage from like Nintendo Directs and E3s. I, I, all I've seen is announcement footage of Devil May Cry. Is it, would I actually like that game? And I know people are gonna go, yeah, 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 yeah. There are like five or six of them. I have the same issue with God of War. Where it's like, oh, God of War 1, God of War 2, God of War 3, God of War, new God of War, God of War, new God of War 2, God of War. No, don't play God of War 2, play God of War 3. Play two and then skip five. And I, I just, it's, I don't know. Where do, where do I start? What should I, what should I actually do? Just do one, two, three, four, and five. No, do one, three, four, and five. Skip two. And skip the reboot, is what I'm being told. I feel like a fake fan if I skip games, though. Well, I'm not even a fan anyways, so who cares? I guess that's true. True fans actually skip two. All right. Okay, I hear you. Two is unbelievably bad. What happened? Why? And if two was so unbelievably bad, then how did they pull it together so well to have three be so good? What, what happened? It's complicated. Yeah, that was fun. That was a really fun game.